up y'all welcome back to the channel for today's video we are finally going to be fixing my stupid stinky uh clutch master cylinder with this blocks cmc it's a s2000 well they go to part number in case you guys want to know what it is right there yes sir so i already run a s2000 uh clutch master cylinder this clutch master cylinder is an ebay brand clutch master cylinder but i mean they always got the job done until well couple i guess weeks ago when my clutch pedal started to feel a little wanky start to feel a little wonky might start to feel a little whoa that iso though hold on pimpin all right back in action let me show you i don't know if you guys can actually see now nah, you probably can yeah that was a bad idea so it's leaking uh it's like a little wet spot <laughs> i'm so childish <laughs> so i do have like a wet spot and you know if your clutch pedal starts to feel a little weird or your gear start to feel like you know like it started to feel weird uh first check your slave your master and then if diagnose those issues and none of them are the culprit then it's probably something to do with your pressure plate or uh, whatever uh, transmission related but in my case it is indeed the clutch master i should have bought a slave too but my slave is good i got a lot like i got oh yeah yeah you, you got why yeah i have pretty good movement with my uh slave so i know it's not the slave it's the master so that's pretty much what we're going to get into today we're going to replace this clutch master cylinder and then we're going to take the tag out for a drive and see the difference in systems i should probably unbox it for you guys huh yeah that that kind of makes sense yeah it kind of makes sense but i mean it's not really much to it it's just a s2000 style uh clutch master cylinder from blocks and i decided to buy the blocks one because it's 58 dollars on ebay and i kind of want to run their four piston uh brake uh caliper upgrade so hopefully that can work out and i'll be a part of the blocks family because i have this i have their muffler and maybe their brakes i don't know but this is it without further ado let's uh dismantle the old one and get the new one installed look what the plastic did to my header dog oh it's so bad <laughs> but here we have our slave i mean our clutch master cylinder and look how nasty that fluid is bro like yucky so i got oh wow uh, yeah you can definitely see how it was leaking because this was capped off and now it's almost low so it's all good you about to get out of here brother you're about to get out of here so i'm gonna drain this out and yeah so i don't mess up the paint on that so i gotta drain this out remove the banjo bolt and all that stuff and yeah remove it from the inside so i'm trying my best to show you guys the uh bad master Hopefully you guys can see it. it uh, you can't, but it's leaking out of like the uh, the shaft, basically. <laughs> so once I remove it, I'll be able to show you guys better. I just tried to do it while I'm here, but yeah, that's uh that's uh, what we replace it right in. I already went ahead and removed the uh, clutch line, so we're good there. So here is my old busted uh, eBay bought uh, clutch master. And as you guys can see, hopefully, it was leaking. Uh, watch out. If you guys can see that, uh, maybe you can. I can't really see on my screen right now. The sun's too bright. But it was leaking from the uh, push rod, this thing right here. So now that that's taken care of, well, I need this right here. Yeah. If you're going to do the S2000, uh, clutch master replacement you're gonna need this plate i bought this from street rays like i don't know a year ago two years ago i can't remember whenever i went for case swap uh it's like i don't know 18 20 bucks i think it was and yeah and the reason why i upgraded to the s2000 one is now the reason why i upgraded my clutch master to the s2000 is because you get better play you get a better clutch feel because it's direct there's no hose it's just right from reservoir to push uh, clutch rod whatever so it's just overall the better upgrade to do so if you want to do it i'll link everything uh down below to how you can buy this stuff and i don't know i'll just leave a link down below in case you want to do this all right yeah i know the zosh famous saying we going from ashy to glassy yeah <laughs> 
I got it all installed, as you guys can see. Yeah, buddy. Uh, and no brake fluid harm my paint, so be careful. If you have a freshly painted engine bay or anything with paint on it, brake fluid will eat it up like a butt muncher. Straight eat. But now I'm bleeding the clutch. Uh, and yes, I have my ten, my eight mil socket right there. Come on, man. Come on, dog. Oh, my eyes are on the honey. Hold on, playboy. Yeah, my. There we go. So yeah, I'm bleeding the clutch right now. I'm letting it drop on the slitter board because I'm buying a new one anyway. And I don't really care because I don't have uh, the necessary tools needed to, you know, properly dispose of the brake fluid. So, whatever. I don't care, dog. <laughs> oh, getting some pedal. Getting bad boy loose. Getting better. Oh, getting that. This is what I have to go through to bleed my clutch by myself. Now that I got good enough pedal pressure, I have no help. Help. So, you guys can't see it, but it's not as stiff as I'd like, but it does feel like the old one, so I guess that's fine, but I do want to bleed it better than this, though. Well, let's uh, go drive it and see if I need to make any more adjustments, and if I do, I'll just uh, wait till Randy get off work or something, and we'll just get it figured out. <laughs>
Hey bro, huh? What are you doing? I don't know, chilling. What are you doing? I'm doing me. What are you doing? Word, word, word. You know you want me. You can't take your eyes away from me. I'm the hottest thing to fly bread. And when the boys see me, they What's up, y'all? So the clutch pedal, um, it's fixed. Uh, to sum this video up, my clutch pedal is fixed. So my clutch pedal is fixed. So my clutch pedal, yeah, how many times am I gonna say this? This is, bro, filming. We now have a fixed clutch pedal. Tomorrow, I am going to re-bleed the slave with, well, re-bleed the clutch with, isn't that racist? Why do they call the slave in them? Like, why is it called the slave? You, you know what I mean? Like. Because they do all the work, because if you think about it, the slave is doing all the work. Because they got to function off, you know, providing pressure to the pressure plate. Like, you know what I mean? Why I got to be called a slave? I'm looking way too deep into it. Alexa, why do they call the slave the slave? Here's something I found on study.com. Slaves used drums for communication because it was the fastest way to deliver a secret message that could not be understood by invaders or slave masters. Drum beats were played at specific rhythms and speeds which correlated with different signals and warnings. Did that answer your question? Man, hell no. Man, bro, I hate Facebook Marketplace, bro. Some guy is selling these Will Wood powder-coated black calipers for 200 bones, but he's not messaging me back. Bro, being single is trash. Can I fast forward to the part of my life where I have a family and a beautiful wife and a home with an Evo parked out front with my Integra, my RSX, possibly a CTR? Man. And like I said earlier in this video, the reason why I went with the S2000 Master, well, Clutch Master Cylinder is because it's better than your OEM EG or DC or EK uh, because it has no reservoir line. It's direct, like it's all compact instead of having, you know, the, uh, the reservoir up top and then have the line go to the master. It's it's cool. I probably, I probably sound dumb trying to explain it to you, but it's just better. It's just overall better. Why wouldn't you want to upgrade? The Slave Master Cylinders are cheap. I bought mine off eBay. It's a Blox one. And I looked online before I hit confirm purchase to make sure like Blox isn't like, you know what I mean? Like it's not a bad unit to buy. And everyone said it was a great unit. So I went with the Blox one instead of like another eBay off brand. I also read online that you should want to like, um, like fluid like uh what's it called when you do a fluid replacement every i don't know like eight months or every six months like twice a year so you can have fresh fluid to keep the uh the uh red the the, the master cylinder for god damn two times a year put fresh uh 
brake fluid into your clutch master cylinder so you can get more longevity out of it, okay? I read it online and it does make sense because my fluid was hella black and I had that fluid in there for like, what, a year and a half now? So if I, probably, if I would've honestly replaced the fluid uh, like in the six months, the first six months that I had it, what? Yeah, I gotta stop trying to explain and sound smart to people because they already they already know I'm dumb as hell. So do what you want with your car. My issue is okay. It's fixed now. Hopefully this dude sells me these Willwood calipers for 200 bucks. That'd be nice. Hey bro, do y'all watch Love is Blind on Netflix? Bro, oh man, man, that show right there. Wow, do 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 pimp. Alright, that's all I gotta say. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. If you like the video, go ahead and subscribe and like button, all that.